the second luminous mystery, the wedding feast at Cana. In this great mystery, we see Jesus performing his first public miracle. It takes place in a place called Cana, not too far from Nazareth, where Jesus grew up. We don't know who the couple were that were being married that day, but Jesus was there, Our Lady was there, and the disciples were there to witness this first miracle. What is always interesting in this great mystery is the part Our Lady plays. She is the one who notices that the couple are in need, that there is no wine, and she brings it to the attention of her son. And it is at her intercession that Jesus performs his first public miracle. We know that in the scripture from the Gospel of St. John, chapter 2, that Jesus says, Woman, my time has not yet come. And Mary tells the servant to do whatever he tells you to do. Mary always pointing us towards her son. It's never about herself. It's always about Jesus. When Our Lady appears in summer, like Lourdes or Fatima, wherever it is, doesn't she always say, build a church? Same in Guadalupe. And this is so that people can come and have an encounter with her son. People can come to Mass, meet Jesus, receive him, listen to his word, and also that they can go to confession. Another thing which strikes me about this great mystery of the luminous mysteries is that we can be Our Lady's servants too through consecration. Many people consecrate themselves to Jesus through Mary, do the great 33-day consecration. And so we're like the servants in this mystery. We listen to Our Lady as she directs us and as we become her servants to carry out the will of God in our lives. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, 
full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of your mercy.